I was born with a strange gift. The ability to see what no human being has ever seen before. It's all mixed up in my head. The images, the sounds, the smell. I need to remember. Put things in order right up to this moment. Remember who I am. If I had to say how it all began, I might just as well start here. I found you by the side of the road in the middle of nowhere. Was there an accident? Did, did someone try to hurt you? How about a name? Someone I could contact? You must have family, friends, someone who could tell me who you are. Hey. You don't talk much, do you? Well, if you don't help me, I can't help you. I get nowhere. Is that a scar? Is that recent? We've got to stop them. They have no idea what they're up against. Tell them to wait until I get there. Get back to them immediately, you hear me? You've got to stop them! Goddamn fools! And the experiments. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Dusk, and we're playing Beyond Two Souls. Ah, there you are. How you doing today, Jody? Good. 
<laughs> I hate to bother you when you're playing and all, but uh, I believe it's time, honey. Girl, you'll have plenty of time to play later. But the toys. Tons of cameras, too. All right, Nathan's waiting for us. Ah, oh, come on. I don't have any more change. Seriously? Hi, Cole. Hey, Alan. This nearly ready. I was due two weeks ago. I Hello, precious. Ready. Don't you look pretty today? Better late than never, I guess. Here we are. It's gonna rain this weekend. We got a lot of rain this year. In the facility behind the scenes. Hasn't been particularly cold, though. No, it hasn't. Babysitting detail, huh, Cole? Ha ha ha, very. Hey, Jody. How's your day been so far? Pretty good. Okay, we're gonna put this on now. Remember? It's just like a crown. Oh, yeah. Oh, now you're a little princess. <laughs> Don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. I'm right next door if you need me, okay? Hey, Jody, can you hear me? Okay, let's start. Kathleen is next door, and she has the same cards as you. And we're gonna get her to choose one and see if you can tell us which one she chose. You think you can do that? Good. All right, let's go for it. First card. What you choose. Hard body experience. Next card. Next card. Look at these lines. Very good, Jody. Let's try something else. There's some building blocks on the table in the other room. I think you can make them fall over. Can we do that? Good, Jody. Anything else in the room you can move? Jody, honey, the experiment is over. The door's locked! I'm no, Kathleen, you. it's not locked. It's probably just stuck. Give here. us a moment. Get me out of here now! 
Calm down, Kathleen. Go get the door. Destruction. You have to stop now, Jody. The test is over. You need to stop. Slot! I can't! He's not listening to me! No! He's not listening to me! <laughs> Calm down, Kathleen. We're on our way. Jody. Something's wrong. He's in danger. Get out of there! It's over. It's over. It will never be over. So is she connected to something or can she control it? You and percentage of players have taken these paths. We're in the minority with Wrecking Havoc and in, also in the minority of Strangling Kathleen. So this game will come with like statistics, it looks like, for that. So we can see how nice choices play out with what other people have chosen. This dress sucks. I knew I should have worn something else. The dress is perfect. You look great. Who are these people? Uh, diplomats, politicians, businessmen, spies. It's the usual embassy crown. But most important thing, act natural. If anyone speaks to you, you just smile. So do you want me to act natural or do you want me to smile? I didn't know you had a sense of humor. Only when I'm scared to death. Ryan, I'm delighted you could attend. Always a pleasure, Sheikha, man. I uh, would like you to meet my assistant, Elizabeth. I was unaware that American diplomacy was undertaken with such disarming charm. The pleasure is mine, Elizabeth. Gentlemen, I give you back your host. We'll talk later on it. Until then, Ryan. He hates me. All the time he was imagining my head on a stick. He found you charming. I should be flattered. Yeah, I'm gonna shake some hands, blend in, find some more quiet. You know what you have to do. Uh, Ambassador, you're a sight for sore eyes. I need to find a quiet place. A quiet place in your mind? Or a quiet, quiet place? Because the most logical thing is to be near the music to be quiet. I have no idea what was done there. Well, I can do this thing. We're tethered. No, not now. It will attract attention. Yes. 
looks like we're in an, an Arabic or Egyptian party. It's more Arabic. I need to find a quiet place. Excuse you. That's not quite enough. All right. Well, Madi, Lagad Ishtar and Mohammed, Taira Jadida, and a Hamuri Hajitan. Taira Sabika cannot but see ya. Nam, Atasa will monte a jitan for London. I mean, I wish you were saying. Oh, that's such a bougie toilet seat right there. It's got a seat on a seat. There's a large painting in one of the rooms upstairs. Behind it is a safe. The documents we're looking for are inside. But there are guards and cameras, so you have to be careful. You got it? So are we Aiden? Hurry, Aiden. It hurts like hell when you're too far away. An office with a portrait of the Sheik. This is the place. Crap. You gotta distract the guard first. Nobody will be able to monitor the main office now. We should be safe. Yeah, no game for you. Now where's the main office? Probably the big double door. Switch somewhere to move the painting. Find it, Aiden. See if you can open the safe. Good job. Now we have to read the documents. Make it quick. I can't hold on much longer. Okay, now don't move. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
هل من أحد هناك؟ الرجاء الخروج من هناك على الفور ولكن ماذا تفعل هنا؟ إن هم رهد السيدات انصرف من هنا حسنا. أيها المنهرس انصرف Sorry, I can't do anything to help you. Good luck. Straight to the sink. Majority 98% finished the mission. Apparently, 2% did not finish the mission. Pause the video undetected. Minority finished the mission without Sheik. Don't know who Sheik is. Finished the mission with Aiden only. Majority. Listen, I'm not sure. Maybe I shouldn't go. Jody, you've been begging me for weeks. You're not gonna back up now. I don't know anybody there. They might all hate me and... This dress is awful. Let's just go. Just take a deep breath. There's no reason to panic. It's just a birthday party. I'm sure everybody will like you. You'll have fun, maybe meet some new friends. Go on. Sometimes I'm oh, a little oblivious. Don't forget your prompt. present. It's a book of poetry by Poe. It's 50 years old and very rare. I'm sure she'll like it. Don't worry. It's going to be all right. His face kind of. I'll pick you up me. at five. Have fun. It's like he has that always smiles, smirk kind of. Come in. Hi. Hey, Kirsten, you come in, I gotta go. Come in, Jody, don't be shy. Hey, Jody, right? Come on, we're in the living room. Some girls from my school and the least dorky guys we could find. Oh, is that a present for me? Cool. Thanks. I'm off, darling. Look after your friends and don't do anything stupid, all right? Sure, Mom, whatever you say. Oh, finally! 
Finally, she gets the hint. Hey everyone, this is Jody. She's in Unit 4 with my mom. Unit 4? The paranormal department? Ooh, what you do there? Bend spoons or speak to dead people? Stuff no. like that? No. Woo! Party spoons. time! I'll get the beer. Guys, do the shutters. Girls, do the candles. And Jody, you can take care of the music. Let's get crazy! Like to bend spoons. <laughs> Those look like iron shades to me. Excuse you, spoon guy. Garbage is that. Slide over. We'll put on something from this century. Something really popping. Oh, how dare you? Oh, I can't fight. Oh. Hit it under my bed for a week. My mom doesn't even go into my room anymore. She's totally oblivious. Kirsten, you're a genius. Daddy, you want one? Yeah, cool, sure. <laughs> hey, don't choke on it. I bet it's your first time. I don't condone no. under drinking. I've had some before. <laughs> of course you have. There's an FYI. Watch if I do this. I'm Matt. Jody, right? I've never seen you at school before. You don't take classes on bass? I'm in a different program. With, with my own teacher. It's, it's kind of boring. <laughs> I, I, I never get to see people my age. I, I suppose I've gotten used to it. So you work with Kirsten's mother? Yeah. We work in the in the same lab. She thought it would be a good idea for me to come and spend time with people my age, so uh, here I am. <laughs> I used to live in, uh, in London before I moved here two years ago. And you? Where did you live before? New York? Probably New York. Man, I love New York. It's awesome. I went there once and it blew me away. Do you have any hobbies? Anything you do for, like, fun? I surf any chance I get and I play in a band with a bunch of friends. <laughs> and you, what are you into? London smile. Nothing special. I read a lot. It's boring, <laughs> I guess. Can I... can I ask you something? Why are you in Unit 4? What is Unit 4? I'd rather not talk about it. 
Sorry, I'm so stupid. I, I hope I haven't like upset you or anything. No, oh, no, she's really the choice. No. Ah, uh, uniform might be slowdowns. Are you, you up for it? You not choose them. <laughs> you know, like other girls, I mean, there's, there's something special about you. I guess you could say that. Oh, no, I didn't select one. All right. Give us a demonstration of her super mega powers. No, <laughs> great no, idea. No, I, I'd pay to see that. Uh, uh, forget yeah, it. It's just what a little bowl. A spoon guy. Yeah, come on, Jody. Show us what you can do. Okay, Jody. You up for demonstration? No, no, I, I, I don't, I don't have anything to show. I told you so, guys. It's all bullshit. Right, okay guys, it's time to eat that delicious cake, and most important, to open my birthday gifts. Actually, the cake can wait. I'm opening my gifts first. Love, Jen, XXX. Oh, that's nice, babe. I bet it's knee socks. A thong, just exactly what I needed. Now you can stop stealing your mom's. <laughs> and improve your chances of finding a decent boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> My future lover wants to thank you for making his life more interesting. What is that? An old book. It smells funky. It's a really rare collection of uh, poems by Edgar Allan Poe. Edgar Allan who? What, did you steal this from your grandpa's library? No, no, and it's really rare. Yeah. Just like your dress. <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, is this a joke? I can't believe you came all the way to my birthday party just to give me this old crap. And she thinks she's so clever. But she's just a little lab rat. A freaky little lab rat. Yeah. She's been following me around like a puppy all evening. Begging for it. Oh. And she's a slut, too. I never wanted to invite her. My mom made me. Yeah, she's a slut. A slut and a witch. We should, like, do something to her. What do you do with witches? You burn them. Ah! Get her! <laughs> <laughs> Please! Stop! Stop! Oh, Mr. Sergeant, the darkness! Let me go! Bring forth your mighty power! <laughs> <laughs> Out. From the first moment I saw I'm her. begging you, please <laughs> let me out! Please! Did someone say cake? Please! No, I want to get out! Please, I want to get out! I'm begging yeah, you! Let's get this please party started! 
I'm supposed to do something. I didn't. I can't breathe. It's in there hovering around her <laughs> in a third perspective. Ah, revenge. Go, Aiden. Cause chaos. Everything! She's been dying! 
Devil! 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 Uh, minority got drunk, majority kissed, majority attacked, minority set the house on fire, majority had powers. An undiscovered path. Probably meant like exploring the house a little is my guess. Your fault we're in trouble, so cut it out. He's replacing Dr. Matthews. He's the one who's gonna be taking care of me from now on. He seems really nice. Go on, he wants to meet you. Go on, hurry up. I'll be right here, sweetheart. Yeah, that was just hovering an item for a little bit. <laughs> Jody, he's waiting for you. <laughs> Hello, Jody. Come in. My name is Nathan. Nathan Dawkins. I thought it would be a good idea for us to have a little chat, get to know each other a little better. That is, if it's okay with you, of course. Jody, my job is to study strange events and then try to explain them. Like the things that happen around you, right, Jody? Your mother tells me you have an invisible friend. This friend, has he been with you a long time? I'm guessing he has been. Since you were born? I guess we're making it up right here. Is he a ghost? Or a spirit of someone who passed away? Can you draw him for me? What does he look like? Ah, uh, yes. Mind if I take a look? So, this thing is your friend, and he's connected to you with some kind of cord. Is he here right now? Can you tell him to do something? You 
tell him what to do, and it happens. I don't tell Aiden what to do. No one does. He's like a lion in a cage. We're tied together. He can't go away. That makes him really angry. It's not my fault. I want him to leave, too. It can be really scary sometimes. Did, did he do that to you? No. That was the monsters. Who are the monsters? Welcome to the CIA. So this is the timeline of events right here. God, every time I see that guy, it reminds me of, uh... From Dean from Supernatural. It's your room. This is where you'll study and sleep for the next three years. Your training starts tomorrow at 5 a.m. Don't be late. Moving? Yeah, we're moving. Keep up! I'm not sure what the movement's here. Huh? What are they? Not going for a sec. That's it, Holmes. Come on. I haven't got all day. <laughs> the longest monkey bars ever. the next cup. Got it?
doing this. Good. Result is wrong. Start again. Oh. Okay, recruit. Now get rid of those oil drums. Good. Let's keep going. This is like the ultra quick tutorial. Sunday stroll! Not bad.
Not bad, Jody. But if this wasn't an exercise, you'd be dead by now. If this wasn't an exercise, you wouldn't even be able to open your big mouth, Ryan. <laughs> Congratulations, Operative Holmes. You made it. Welcome to the agency. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Jody. Welcome to the agency. Hey, it's like you Great made job, it, Jody. Congratulations. Really good. Welcome to the CIA. Good physical shape, not spotted during training. Tremendous fighter. Wow, look at that. On that note, thank you so much for watching this lovely tale of Jody and Beyond Two Souls. And I'll catch you in the next one.